Mark. As President of the Hutton Valley Chamber of Commerce, I also wish to welcome you all to the 2019 Wellington Regional Business Excellence Awards. I am personally very excited by the optimism and positivity of all of the award finalists and applicants this year. It's okay to stand up and be positive. And I'm very proud to be part of an event like tonight that puts that message on loudspeaker to everyone in our community. Whilst the MC has formally welcomed the distinguished guests, I wish to endorse that welcome. I'm extremely thankful for the commitment that politicians from both central and local government have in their support for our chamber and the businesses that we represent. And the presence here tonight is an endorsement of that commitment. I must take this opportunity to offer a special thanks to our event sponsors, who will be individually acknowledged throughout the evening for their support. It is absolutely essential for the success of this event and we truly value your partnership. This year, there are 12 award categories, with each being judged by independently appointed judges. The judging task requires a significant time commitment. And with the judges' identity being confidential, they receive very little recognition. May I request that you acknowledge and thank our judges, many of whom are here tonight, in the customary manner. This is the 13th time we have run these awards in this current format. And as Mark said, this year we received the most entries we have ever received. So to say that all the finalists tonight should be proud, whether they win or not, is especially true. And I want to acknowledge every single one of you for that achievement. Yep, there's an unspoken elephant in the room. We're business people. We like to win. And being a finalist and not winning your category can feel like a disappointment. That's just the honest truth. I've been there myself, and not everyone tonight is going to win the category. But there is a way that every finalist tonight can win, and that is the theme I want to talk about. If there's one theme I'd like everyone to take away with them tonight, it is the value of reflection and self-review. If you're a finalist tonight, you know from recent experience how difficult it can be to look in the mirror and answer questions about the inner workings and performance of your business. And because this is an awards application where you're being judged and you want to win, the answers to those questions naturally focus on the best of what you do and the areas you perform strongly. Where everyone tonight can win is to go back to the prep work you did for your applications the drafts, the documents that had the gaps where you weren't sure how to answer or the sections where you felt it wasn't so easy to demonstrate that you were strong. You all know the areas I'm talking about, they were the uncomfortable ones. It's in those areas where there is gold. It is in those areas that we can see the gaps we don't always notice when we're busy running our business day to day. It's in those areas that have the potential to have dramatic effects on our business results. So go back to those areas next week, dig them out, discuss them with your teams, your leadership group, your advisors, hold up the areas where you aren't as strong as you could be and make some plans to change them. Every small change makes a difference and progress is better than perfection. Just imagine the impact on our region if every single business went through this process every single year. If they put serious energy into reflecting on what was going really well in their business, and reviewing areas they could improve. Imagine the culture that would breed within every business and the growth that would lead to within our economy. So again, congratulations to all our finalists. You've done exactly that this year. And I hope regardless of winning or not, you take that self-review back after these awards and use it to make your business even stronger than it already is. If you're here as a guest and haven't entered the awards before, think seriously about entering next year. Or even just getting the application pack and going through the process of self-review. And to those of you that do win your categories, you get the dual victory. You can use the learnings from your application process and revel in the fact that you've been independently judged as the best business in the region in your category and are a leader in the business community. I'd like to briefly acknowledge our team tonight preparing this event as a massive undertaking. Anna, Linda, Helen, wherever you are, 
and our team of suppliers have worked extremely hard to make tonight happen, and the results speak for themselves. Thanks, team. We have a great evening in store for you tonight. Good luck to all the finalists, enjoy the celebrations, and thank you for being here to help us celebrate business excellence in our region. Thank you.